Boost back for reviews gonna be taking a look at a different different kind of thing right now. Um, this is Rogue's Sriracha Hot Hot Stout beer. Um, Rogue um, is of course out of Newport, Oregon. I've had a lot of their things. Uh, some of them are really good. Some of them, some of them um, are kind of like you aren't gonna get your money's worth. They're kind of like a regular run-of-the-mill things, and you're paying above that. But this one isn't interesting. I think I paid 14 bucks for this bottle. Sriracha, if you don't know, is like a um, oriental red sauce mm -hmm. um, that uh, um, people put on their food and stuff like that that, I, that I, I'm not partial to, but I've had it before and I like it. Um, so this is just a different thing that Rogue came out with. It doesn't have a page on on Brav. It, it does. It does have a page on Rate Beer. However, there are no ratings. It's pretty pretty new. Um, it's 55 IBU and 5.7 ABV. Um, it's great. It's rated enjoy to drink with soup, sauces, pasta, pizza, hot dogs, hamburgers, chow mein, or anything you would like to wash down with it with a spicy kick. Okay, so pour it a little bit here. I'll pour a little more here. Okay. Well, um, it it didn't really ever make ever make much of a head, but there's like a little slightly like less than one finger brown head that's gonna have some nice lacing, as you can see. Um, My nose is kind of stuffed though, so I'm not going to have an accurate smell of this. I do pick up what it smells like. A hot, spicy thing. I can't, can't really pick out what or how. Um, and there, and that's really all I get. I mean, the spice is, spice is strong in the nose. There isn't really much nose at all. That's probably because I can't smell right now because I'm stuffed up. Bad, like huge. Badly stuffed up. So let's go ahead and try it since I can't smell anything. I don't get any coffee, however, there's a slight bit of chocolate and body malts, there's no, no breadiness at all. So you have like a, something like, something similar to a Guinness extra, extra stout, um, you know, not too pungent or not too prominent on really any, any aspect, you know, typical chocolatey stout, has a little bit of chocolate kind of thing going on. And at the and at the back end, the heat comes in. The heat isn't strong, but it's there. You know, it's more of a kick. You know, um, it's a kick, and it's not it's not 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 nearly as hot as um, the the Ghostface Killer or some other chili beers out there. I've been hearing hearing about this for a while. This beer, I've been hearing about it for a while. I'm happy I finally got to try, finally got to try it. Um, if you drink one sip after the other, the the heat will kind of build up in the back. <sighs> Mouthfeel is light to medium. Um, it's dry. It's drinkable. It's not not refreshing though because it's hot. Um, and I'm not. I don't know, I think I'm really happy I bought it just, just to try it, but I'm not that, you know, I'm not really amused or, um, you know, I, it's not really anything to be worried about or to be, it's not, it's not, it's, it, it isn't really anything to go, to go out of your way for. It's not, it's not anything to, um, think is awesome because it's not awesome. Um, yeah, it does have the kick, but there's no real stout, stout flavors there. It's a tad bit of chocolate, and that's it. There's no real stout flavors. It's like a stout background with just a little bit of 
a little, little bit of a stout flavor, and then they put it in the hot stuff, which, I don't know, I think this is just a, another one that I really think is kind of a flop, um, I'm sorry to say. Um, I'm going to give this beer a C, and I'm going to say that because I think, um, Stone smoke porter with chipotle peppers is better because that at least has some background flavors of a stout or a porter and then has some hot stuff. This is just like a like a skeleton of a stout, if, if it is a stout at all, and then hot, hot stuff. So if you want to go ahead and try it, you can. Um, don't expect amazing things, though.